Hi everyone, welcome to Clappy Puffy channel again. Today I'll be teaching you guys about how to make this very simple pink ribbon beanie. It's just a kind of beanie that add on a ribbon only. And I can say that this is very easy for beginners. Alright, here we go. You will need to prepare 200 gram of 5 ply milk carton yarn and a 3.5 mm hook. And here I'll be using new pink yarn color for my hat. First, do a slip knot. Next, do 49 chain. After you got 49 chain, let's come from the last chain to the 8th chain. Attach a stitch marker on it. This is to remind you that you have to do 8 single crochets here. Let's back to the beginning chain and start to work on half double crochet. Yarn over. Insert your hook into the second chain. Yarn over and pull out a loop. Now you got 3 loops on your hook. Yarn over again and pull through all 3 loops on your hook. So that's how we do half double crochet. Do half double crochet all the way until you reach the stitch marker. There will be 40 half double crochets before we change to single crochet. Remove the stitch marker. Let's start to do single crochet. Insert your hook into the next chain. Yarn over and pull out a loop. Now you got two loops on your hook. Yarn over again and pull through all two loops on your hook. So that's how we do single crochet. Do single crochet all the way until the end of the row. So there will be 40 half double crochets and 8 single crochets in the first row. Let's move on to the second row. Chain 1 and turn your work. Let's count from the beginning stitch to the 8th stitch. Attach the stitch marker on the 8th stitch. This is to remind you that you have to do 8 single crochet back loops only first. Find the first stitch and insert your hook into the back loop. Yarn over and pull out a loop. Yarn over again and pull through both loops on your hook. Do single crochet back loops only all the way until you reach the stitch mark. Remove the stitch marker and do the last single crochet back loop only. Let's start to do half double crochet back loops only. Yarn over and insert your hook into the back loop. Yarn over and pull out a loop. Yarn over again and pull through all three loops on your hook. Do half double crochet back loops only all the way until the end of the row. So there will be 8 single crochet back loops only and 40 half double crochet back loops only in the second row. Let's move on to the third row. 
Let's count from the beginning stitch to the 40 stitch. Attach a stitch marker on it. This is to remind you that you have to do 40 half double crochet back close only first. Do 40 half double crochet back close only. Do 8 single crochet back loops only. So there will be 40 half double crochet back loops only and 8 single crochet back loops only for the third row. Repeat the second row and the third row for the respective row. For free size, I will do 55 rows for the pack. It will form a crocheted rectangle like this when you have finished crocheting the amount of the rows you want. You can add more rows if you want bigger size. Next, we are going to seam the two sides together. Put the crocheted rectangle into half. We are going to use slip stitch method to seam the sides. Chain 1 and insert your hook into the back loop and also the stitch behind. Yarn over and pull through the only one loop on your hook. Do slip stitch all the way until the end of the row to seam the sides together. Next, we are going to gather the top of the head at a single crochet part. Insert the yarn into every row or every two rows. Put a yarn tail to secure the head when you reach the last row. We have finished the simple bini.
Let's flip over your beanie to the outside part, which is the slip stitch cannot be seen. Let's come to the last patch, which needs us to crochet a ribbon on the top of the hat. Click knot. Next, do 25 chains. Next, we are going to do half double crochet into the second chain. And we have to do in total of 24 half double crochet in the first row. You will just need to repeat the first row for the respective row. I will do 15 rows of 24 half double crochets for the ribbon. Next, we are going to fold this small crochet third rectangle into three parts. Hold the center of the folded crochet third rectangle. Cut a piece of yarn and tie a small bundle. Remember to leave two long yarn tails to attach it on the hat. But well don't guess if you have done this simple pink ribbon beanie with me. So this is how the simple ribbon beanie looks when you wear it on it. So if you guys like my video, please do not forget to give it a like or can leave down any feedbacks below. And if you wish to have more crochet patterns or tutorials, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more updates.
थैंक यू